has the misfortune to find themselves in my web. <laughs> shh, 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 no, no. Don't struggle. You'll hurt yourself in those pretty wings of yours. <laughs> oh, love. Unfurling those wings at me. Mm. Oh, you moth babies are so cute. So twitchy and reactionary. You managed to blind yourself in your struggle, didn't you? Goodness. <laughs> uh, sh 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 yes, I have eight arms, love. You're in my spider web. And my dear. And I am the spider. Don't fret too much, okay? I'm not your standard drider. Lovely, I'm a bit more arachnophobia friendly. <laughs> Here, see for yourself. There we are. Oh, <laughs> oh that look you're giving me. Fear intriguing and a little lust <laughs> remember wait you're one of those kind of moths hmm. you zip into my study tonight because of my pretty little light trap or because you were fascinated by tales of the drider that supposedly drags in moths butterflies and other non-apex insects do well, heaven knows that. Do I eat them? Do I torture them? <laughs> I'm just gonna look at you. My little fuzzy siren. Oh, look at you. <laughs> My little fuzzy siren. Oh, you're so vibrantly colored. You're not poisonous, no. A rosy silk moth aspect, are you? <laughs> how cute! I always love a little how indigenous your kind looks. Flapping those tiny wings, antennas bobbing about. You lots always seem to have that little... Little man syndrome condition. <laughs> oh no. Mr. Dryder, please don't eat me. Oh please, I don't want to be liquefied. Careful, darling. All that struggling and... You're going to trigger my predator insta instincts. And if you're foolish enough to twist around and show me your back... I'll simply have to eat you. And not in the lustful way. <laughs> it's in my nature, after all. Why do I not look like the other driders? Well, I'm a halfling of sorts. Half drider, half elf. I inherited my mother's elven beauty. In frame, and my father's... Well, and <laughs> his apex tendencies, and I assume I was largely left to myself after both of them passed. Hmm? Oh, no, no. I fear they were violently killed by or for their love when I was quite young. <laughs> Did they? <laughs> You're such a cute one, you know. About to potentially be devoured by a sadistic drider in a dark castle. Where no one will ever find you. And you gently apologize for my suffering. You're so... What is it? Oh, sensitive. Wings, yeah? Love, I'll remember that. But for now, 
Let me look. You have a hole in this wing. No wonder you fumbled your way into my lab. You're not an idiot, you're just injured. Perhaps a little kinky. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't let you out of this big and scary world injured, can I? That'd be especially rude of me, especially as a doctor. Oh, darling, I've been alive a long, long time. I think Mother might have been a vampire, pish posh. Who cares? Anytime I try to open myself up to take a look, I get to my ribcage before I think. Ashton, you fool. You don't know what a vampire looks like being dissected, silly goose. And then I have to sew myself up again, trying not to giggle. Terribly difficult. I think I still have my scalpel in here somewhere. Um, oh, there it is. I should probably do something about that, but you are so much more interesting than my very alien anatomy. <laughs> Please don't hurt you. Oh, oh, you are my treat, my dear, my love, my little Rosie. Why would you say such hurtful things? True, true, I may have been very intimidating this entire time, love. I'm a spider. A spider vampire. Potentially. My entire aesthetic is intimidation. There are bigger predators, always, and it is in my interest to appear scary. But with you, well, honestly, it's just fun to see you shake on those little knees locked together. Though... I might do something ungentlemanly. Are you scared or expectant? <laughs> oh, you are precious. Pink and yellow. Puff of fuzz. Yes, I am scary. Very, very scary. Maybe even a little deranged. But I can be reasoned. And in, in the forest and skies, with the nature as your only lover. Well, that truly is an abusive romance, isn't it? Think. You can be out there minding your own business, falling in love, dancing, seeking your purpose. And then what? A harpy swoops down and tears out your innards and while you thrash desperately to save your own life. Every instinct in you struggling, screaming in agony while the harpy has his meal. He doesn't care for your pain. He has to eat. Nature is a psychopath. It cannot be reasoned with. It has no respect for our lives. You think being out there is freedom, yes? <laughs> You came here because you were curious. You knew you'd either find purpose here, or death. And were it death, you wanted to be on your terms. Admit it. It's alright. Be honest with yourself. You don't want to think about all those nasty thoughts in your mind, do you? Why am I here? What is my purpose? What am I meant to do? Questions. Hmm? No. You want to be happy. Isn't that right? To feel free. That's why you came. You knew I'd free you one way or another. <laughs> Are you still frightened? Or do you feel safe knowing that I know how to take care of you? <laughs> ah, here you go. There we are. Rosie, out of my web. And come, sit on my lap. And let me look at that poor little wing. Oh, 
Are you still indigenous, my dear? You are the one burying your <laughs> pretty face into my chest. Oh, shh, 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 shh. I'll take care of you now. You never have to worry about the cruelty of the world again. Just my cruelty. <laughs> So, what do you think? You just get some rest now, okay? Hey guys, hope you guys did enjoy this audio. If you did, you can let me know any way you think is fine. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Um, It is has been amazing. Yeah, I love all of you guys so much. Thank you guys for everything. But as always, if you are listening to this as you're about to fall asleep, Shudu, hope you have an amazing sleep tonight. You had an amazing day today, and you have a great day tomorrow. As always, bye-bye, and good night. Sleep well.